Each of us has been affected by the worldwide pandemic as family and friends have unexpectedly moved beyond mortality. While we weep, we also rejoice in the glorious resurrection of our Savior. Because of Him, our loved ones and friends continue their eternal journey. Our eternal perspective not only enlarges our understanding of those who are continuing their journey beyond mortality, but also opens our understanding of those who are earlier in their journey and just now entering mortality. Each person who comes to earth is a unique son or daughter of God. Some may question if life begins with the formation of an embryo, or when the heart begins to beat, or when the baby can live outside the womb. But for us, there is no question that spirit daughters and sons of God are on their own personal journeys, coming to earth to receive a body and experience mortality. As covenant children of God, we love, honor, nurture, safeguard, and welcome those spirits who are coming from the pre-mortal world. Let us share our deep feelings about the sanctity of life with those who make decisions in society. They may not fully appreciate what we believe, but we pray that they will more fully understand why, for us, these decisions go well beyond just what a person wants for his or her own life. If an unanticipated child is expected, let us reach out with love, encouragement, and when needed, financial help. Strengthening a mother in allowing her child to be born and continue his or her journey in mortality. I testify that your own personal journey as a child of God did not begin for you as the first flow of Earth's air came rushing into your lungs. And it will not end when you take your last breath of mortality. May we always remember that each spirit child of God is coming to earth on his or her own personal journey. May we welcome them, safeguard them, and always love them. As you receive these precious children in the Savior's name and help them in their eternal journey, I promise you that the Lord will bless you and shower his love and approval upon you 